e um fusquinha na calçada Bicicleta amarela e o calor last lecture and now I just have a supervision at some point yet to be determined and another supervision at some point yet to be determined both of which I have to submit work for but in theory Lent term is done. I am so tired at this point. The weather is horrible. I think Cambridge is trying to flood itself before it's gonna be really sunny from tomorrow onwards. And so what I think I'm gonna do is just make myself some kind of food and celebrate for a second the fact that I just had my last lecture and technically term is now finished, even though I have more work. It feels so strange that Lent term is already finished because in some ways it doesn't even really feel like it's been a term, like it just kind of happened and now I just have exam term left after Easter until I'm done with my degree, which I'm not entirely sure that I'm on board with. Um, at least for now it's still only March so I don't have to worry about that just yet, although exams are going to be a thing. Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever I feel so free, oh my sweet baby I was never the one to give up the ghost, no, I was so stuck I Kept on playing my part, wanted to give up cause nothing was changing But with you it's so clear and now that you're here I see colors in every spectrum Cause I finally learned my lesson Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah you, you're making me wanna try forever I feel so free Oh my sweet baby so wait, we need to get them in the I think to myself And I'm thinking out loud We won't need nothing else For the rest of our time And I know it so well I will always be by your side All the pieces back together Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever I feel so free You oh, my sweet baby Cause you, you are the pieces 
pieces back together Yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me wanna try forever I feel so free, oh my sweet baby done yesterday as you can see I never really normally get my nails done I also bought a plant yesterday Lily she's my new vanilla plant hopefully she will grow big and tall maybe she can encourage me to get the rest of my assignments done so that I can take an actual break now let's do some psycholinguistics From all things at once Without thinking twice And I knew it would catch up And that we would be the ones Left behind mm. The stories I've been told They never seem to lead my mind mm. And this road that I am on Gotta stay here for some time I was going to start it yesterday but yesterday today I was too tired and ended up just spending the entire evening crocheting so we haven't started this yet and we now have three hours to do it but I'm pretty sure I can do it in three hours because in the exam I'll only have 90 minutes to work on this type of assignment so we should be good. There's also a, an upper word limit of 1500 words in this case which it's good because I would go over that. It's a really lovely day today. It's really chilly outside at the moment, but I think it's gonna be really nice today. So fingers crossed. Uh, but for now, we're gonna sit and work on this assignment. I hope we make it through and then we can take a bit of a break once we're done. my cleaner who just came in so I think I'm gonna head to John Lewis and pick up some yarn because I'm running out so I haven't finished my assignment but it's okay it's fine I'll get it done as soon as I get back maybe this time away from it will give me some perspective and make it a little bit easier for me to actually complete it we can hope <laughs> Oh, 
by Costa on the way to get some hot chocolate. Could I have made this at home? Yes. Well, the fact that I spent £3.50 on this made me feel more productive. Mm. Does it taste good? Yeah. Do I feel like I deserve it? Not yet, but I will. Once I finish this question. Wish me luck. that assignment and I'm going to reward myself with some more crocheting. What can I say, I'm kind of obsessed. It's one of my favourite things to do at the moment and so I don't see why I shouldn't do this. The weather was also kind of nice, it was nice when I was out earlier, but the other kind of negative thing about the weather being really nice here in Cambridge is that it attracts every single tourist and student to go outside in the city centre and sit on King's Parade and it makes it so crowded and so I always have this like battle within myself as to whether I should go out and enjoy the sunshine or whether I should stay inside and avoid the crowds. <laughs> really quickly to do a food shop. Um, I'm only staying in Cambridge for another week so I don't need that much but it's a good opportunity in the 30 minutes that I have to learn to pick up my laundry. To let it pass. excited about today. I'm going out to go for a nice walk with some friends in just under 10 minutes and after that I have a supervision which doesn't count as part of the good vibes of today, that's just gonna happen. But then at 4 today I have an appointment to get my ears pierced. I'm getting my seconds done. Hang on, I'll put some earrings in so you can actually see. Okay so as you can see I currently have my ears pierced just in the one place. Uh, but I'm getting my seconds done right next to them and I am very nervous but also very excited and I'm also doing a call with my lovely friends later on today it's our three year friend anniversary three years since we all kind of became really really good friends on a trip to Florence in first year and yeah I'm just really excited to get going with today the weather is so lovely the sun is really starting to warm and it's like it feels like summer but then it's also really confusing because sometimes the air isn't really quite warmed up so you can still feel that it's March but the sun is like fully in like July mode and I got to wear my new flowery jumpsuit which I've never worn before and I just love it so much it makes me so happy but yeah let's get this day started Am 
I the only one who really loves the smell of sun cream? It just reminds me of summer and warmer times and this one in particular reminds me of Constance in Germany where I was last year because that's where I got it, as you can see from the German on it. So I am a person who burns very easily in the sun and I'm not going to let the fact that it's March fool me into a safe sense of security. So, sun screened up, let's go. Officially done with the term where I have to start revising for my exams, which are in less than three months. Yay! Supervision actually went quite well. I was positively surprised. <laughs> basically finished with my table runner that I'm making but I'm making some extra little squares in different colours and different colour combinations because I'm really indecisive and I can't decide on what configuration and what layout I want to go with so I'm going to try out some different combinations and see where I land and then all I need to do is just stitch the little squares together to form an actual table runner and then I'll be done. It's time to leave for my ear piercing appointment. I am so nervous, but it's gonna be fine. We'll come out of it with two holes in my ears instead of just the one. I'm gonna survive, I'm hyping myself up. Let's go.
afternoon and I'm going to say again just how nice the weather has been lately. Sunlight gives me such a serotonin boost. I think I'm part plant because I definitely photosynthesize to some extent and just the fact that I can go outside in like a skirt and a t-shirt in March and not be cold is just... As you can see, I got my ears pierced yesterday. I got my seconds done. One on that side and one on this side. And it was a really cool experience. I brought my friend Cassie along with me for moral support, which was really, really nice because she could distract me while I was having a needle shoved through my ear. I went to like a proper piercing studio and got it done with a needle, which is a lot better than like a piercing gun. But yeah, they don't really hurt at the moment. To be honest, I kind of forget that I got them done because they really haven't been painful at all. I'm also just really excited that I went for it because I've been talking about getting my seconds for a really, really long time and I think it just looks so pretty. And yeah, it was a really fun experience to mark the end of term. One thing I have done is decide on the configuration and layout of my table runner that I'm crocheting so I can actually start sewing that together. I might do so tonight or I might start it tomorrow but I think I know what I want it to look like. Think being the key word because I am indecisive as all hell. My friends we are going to this amazing bakery that's at the market there and Ely is only about 15 minute train ride away from Cambridge it's this lovely little village with this amazing cathedral and it's just really nice to go every now and again because it takes you out of the Cambridge bubble but it's still a really pretty place and they have the amazing George's bakery there which is so good so I'm excited let's go It's only like two months now that I've done it. Yeah. So it's like when you move.